So let's add another activity. Here's another scenario. Let's create a program that asks user for his or her grade like A, B, C, or F. So A for outstanding, B for very good, C for good, and F for failed. So let's create another class and name it Grading Program. Add this line of code inside your main. Then let's plan what to create. First, ask user for his or her grade. Then, if grade is A, print outstanding. B, print very good. C, print good. And F failed. Now let's start coding. First, you have to import scanner. And instantiate it. Then print instruction for the user. Then accept the user's input. So string input is equal to scanner.next. Then get the first character of the input. So car grade input that car at zero. Then case grade opening closing curly braces. So case A again, don't forget to put this single code. Then system that out that print. Outstanding. And then break. Case B, system that out that print, very good, then break. Case C, print good, and then break. Then case F, print fail, then break. Default. System that out that print, invalid input, and then break. 
So all these codes work the same with our previous program. The difference is yung value ng case natin is A, B, C, and F. So let's test our program. Input C. Result is good. Next, F. Failed. Okay. Next, the V, invalid input. Now, let's try small letter A. This should print out outstanding, right? But why it's wrong input? Yes, kasi again, in Java, small letter A is not equal to capital letter A. So, we need to fix our program. Yes, let's use the two uppercase method of string class. So add that method here. Input to uppercase that car at zero. This means that the value of input variable will be converted into capital letters first, and then the first character will be retrieved. Now, rerun the program. Now it's correct. So if you have questions and clarifications, please comment it down below. Thank you all for watching. Have a good day.